today we are going to know the answer of a question that are protons and neutrons fundamental particles actually we will see the answer of this question that uh, the protons and neutrons are fundamental particle or not on the basis of uh, the level of our knowledge of physics in present uh, days actually uh, when we talk about in the framework of uh, particle physics the fundamental particles are defined as the basic building blocks of matter and uh, these particles cannot be broken down into the uh, smaller components in other words you can say that in the framework of particle physics the fundamental particles uh, are the particles which have no internal structure okay so if a particle has no internal structure then you can say that uh, the particle is a fundamental particle so uh, in the early stage in the development of uh, particle physics when neutrons and protons were discovered uh, the people thought that these particles are fundamental particles but after the advent of quark model or quark theory now at present time it is believed that protons and neutrons have internal structure they are actually composed of quarks and so they cannot be called a fundamental particle if you will think about the composition of a proton Uh, on the basis of quark theory actually when scientist looked into the internal structure of proton uh, they found that actually our proton is composed of three quarks um, and among those three quarks there are two up quarks which i have denoted here by the symbol u and u and one down quark so you can say that actually the proton is composed of two up quark and one down quark so it is uh, symbolically represented as u u d okay now uh, we can calculate all the quantum numbers all the properties of proton on the basis of this quark structure but here uh, for simplicity i will talk only about one of its important property and that is its charge actually you know that uh, charge of a charge of up quark when you talk about up quark its charge is plus 2 by 3e it means its charge is uh, less than that of the charge of a, an electron or proton or in fact it is two third of the charge of electron but positive while the charge of a down quark is minus 1 by 3 e okay so if you want to find the charge of a proton what will be that charge of a proton you can find it as its structure is u u d so its charge will be equal to what charge of one up quark which is 2 by 3 e plus charge of the second up quark which will be 2 by 3 e plus charge of the down quark which is minus 1 by 3 e and you can check do the algebra that this is equal to plus e so charge of a proton is plus e okay now similarly uh, on the basis of quark theory we can see that actually when we talk about the composition of a neutron a neutron is also composed of three quarks but uh, in this case there are two down quarks this d represents actually the down quark and one up quark okay so symbolically a neutron is uh, written as d d u 
न्यूट्रॉन इज रिटर्न एज डी डी यू एंड इफ योर एम इज टू फाइंड द चार्ज ऑफ ए न्यूट्रॉन ऑन द बेसिस ऑफ द स्क्वार्क मॉडल चार्ज ऑफ ए न्यूट्रॉन वाट विल बी दिस यू कैन कैलकुलेट ए चार्ज ऑफ ए डोन क्वार्क इज माइनस वन बाय थ्री ई प्लस चार्ज ऑफ एनदर डोन क्वार्क विच विल बी ऑल्सो माइनस वन बाय थ्री ई एंड प्लस चार्ज ऑफ एन अप क्वार्क विच इज प्लस टू बाय थ्री एंड सो दिस इज इक्वल टू जीरो सो न्यूट्रॉन इज ए चार्जलेस पार्टिकल एंड इट इज सपोर्टेड बाय दिस क्वार्क मॉडल ओके सो फाइनली यू कैन से एज द प्रोटोन एंड न्यूट्रॉन हैज इंटरनल स्ट्रक्चर सो इन द फ्रेमवर्क ऑफ पार्टिकल फिजिक्स वी कैन नॉट से दैट दीज टू पार्टिकल्स आर फंडामेंटल पार्टिकल्स बिकॉज इट कैन बी फर्दर डिवाइडेड इन टू इट्स कंपोनेंट्स दिज डोन एंड अप क्वार्स आर द कंपोनेंट्स ऑफ न्यूट्रॉन एंड प्रोटोन बट इफ यू टॉक अबाउट क्वार्क्स do these quarks have any internal structure answer is no you if you talk about electrons do uh, the, this electron has any internal structure answer is no similarly neutrons and various types of gauge bosons like uh, photons w and z z bosons these particles have no internal structure they are actually not composed of the Uh, quarks and if uh, these particles have no internal structure so it is uh, thought that these particles are the fundamental particles so you can say that quarks electrons or in general you can say leptons uh, uh, and <clears throat> and various types of gauge bosons like photons and wz bosons these are actually the fundamental particles because these have no internal structures such as <coughs> because no internal structure so these particles are called fundamental particles internal structure but as you know that uh, our quest of knowledge is unending it, it never actually stops before the advent of quark theory the people thought that uh, neutron and proton are fundamental particle they have no internal structure they cannot be further divided into uh, the smaller components but after the discovery of quark theory uh, all these facts were changed similarly you cannot guarantee that uh, in the near future this uh, a uh, electron these quarks this neutrino and these uh, bosons uh, can not be uh, treated like uh, a fundamental particle it is possible uh, in the coming discovery that it uh, will be confirmed that they have also internal structure but our present knowledge on the basis of our present knowledge you can say that uh, these particles have no internal structure and so they are called fundamental particles okay but as i have told you that it is worth noting that the concept of fundamental particles may evolve as scientific knowledge progresses okay and new discoveries or insights could potentially change our understanding of the fundamental nature of particles okay thank you very much